Topping our health cast today, researchers at the University of Florida have discovered a way to alter fentanyl, making that very potent pain reliever a little bit safer. Scientists at UF, in collaboration with other universities around the country, were able to modify fentanyl's chemical structure to affect how it interacts with your pain receptors. They also did this in an attempt, of course, to reduce the risk of respiratory depression as well as death. There's a team of superstars that are working on this. There was a researcher in uh, USC in Southern California that realized that there was a molecular switch inside the receptor that we could potentially take advantage of. And then the chemist out at um, uh, Washington University in St. Louis, Sush Majumar, designed a compound that could actually reach those sites and then cause a safer interaction with the opioid receptor that would end up producing all the analgesic responses that we need to treat pain without the liabilities that we're seeing like that respiratory depression. Such a great idea. Study co-author, you hear him right there, Dr. Jay McLaughlin with the UF College of Pharmacy says the research can be expanded now to target other receptors that may lead to improvements in medications for substance abuse, for mood disorders, and other health conditions. And late yesterday, an FDA advisory committee endorsed over-the-counter sales of the overdose reversal drug Narcan. That recommendation would make the nasal spray used to counterock fentanyl and opioid overdoses a little more accessible to consumers. Consumers. They could actually buy that medication at stores without a prescription or even a pharmacist's recommendation. The FDA usually follows its advisory committee's recommendations, but it is not obligated to do that. The federal agency is expected to decide what to do by the end of March.